Hey guys, what is going on? It's Don and Dave here from Pandemic Playgrounds. And today we are going to be working on our base, maybe? Or our thoughts is to actually pick up my respawn pod. But uh, we'll see how far we get. So uh, let's get started. All right, so instead of boring you guys with the whole building a mini drill, which we will advance later, uh, we, we just built something and put something together so we could get some quick materials to continue on our quest of grabbing our respawn pod. So uh, this was Dave's little... Oh, actually, you actually got three pistons on there. Oh, wow, this is going to go deep. Yeah, <laughs> it's going to go fairly deep to get the stone and hopefully get the iron, but we'll see how it goes. We're probably not going to rotate it for the initial one because we are in need of a lot of material so we're just gonna go straight down okay so, just to grab whatever we can first yeah this is just my basic setup with the ro rotor advanced rotor to do a little bit of circular motion once we have enough we just build another drill on the sides to extend it i think we extend it up to five maybe four or five? five maybe five so are we gonna keep this small grid here uh for now <laughs> why not a little bump stop <laughs> Why not? It's 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 a little design, I guess. <laughs> All right, I'm um, gonna start working on the trailer system while you fetch for some ores. Yep, and then we'll just keep building up the system. So yeah, sounds like a plan. Okay, uh, I need to set up my hot bar again. So we're gonna need landing gear to start. So I'm gonna pop in a landing gear, a couple of blocks, wheels. Uh, let's see, wheels. Uh, should we do off-road wheels? What are you using on your ship right now? Off-road or regular? I think regular. Regular. All right, regular. I'm gonna do... Regular? Regular. Regular, yeah. I'm going to do off-road. Oh, yeah. Gear. And we also still have an issue with the shared inertia. Yeah, I don't know what's going on with that. piston system. We do have an experimental mode, but... It still doesn't want to show up. So we got to look into that a little bit more um to see what's going on but we're gonna have a really wobbly drill system it's gonna be the first time i'm building a really wobbly system so we're gonna have to we see how it react. goes <laughs> everything's gonna probably move really really slow yeah try to keep it slow slow okay you know what i don't need to build this landing gear it should be good unbuilt right i set that to point zero one that is super slow but I'm okay with that. <laughs> as long as it doesn't blow up in our faces, I think we're good. Okay, how yeah. about the respawn pod? Um, we're gonna put a crane on this too, right? So I got, I need a pretty good lengthy. What, what are you trailer. building specifically? A trailer for our rover, or you're making right a, a brand a trailer, new rover? So your rover could connect to this trailer, and we're gonna build a crane on this trailer as well, so we gotcha. could lift up our rover. Uh, so you're just making the flatbed, basically. Oh, yes. Flatbed. All right, cool. That's the plan. Sounds good. See how your design comes out. I'm done. <laughs> We're going to just drive some steel plates. <laughs> We're too poor. We're too poor. <laughs> uh, not necessarily. I think... Uh... Oh, I need more steel plates. 
We're good with steel plates, right? I could grab like 50. That should yeah, be more yeah, than yeah. We, could, we could produce a lot more since we're getting a lot more stone. Um, we should be getting a decent amount with the drill system now. All right, it's going to be five wide. All right, I'm going to make this drill system a little bit faster. I'm a little impatient here. Uh, I don't even know if it's going to blow up on us. It might. It's already kind of shaky, but but we're going straight down. It should be okay to go a little bit faster. Once I get it rotating, that's when it's going to get a little bit iffy. Yeah, it's just we, we got to deal with it until we can figure out what's wrong with the um, shared inertia. All right, we need more steel plates. Produce a whole bunch. Let's just produce a bunch. I just put in a hundred. We need more. Than okay. That. Let's put in a thousand. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> We could put in a thousand. We're always going to need steel plates. Yeah. Um, I got to see how we're going to attach the landing gear onto your thing. So I have a little idea. I've done, I done a trailer system before on another build where I use a hinge, two hinges. So it would flex up and down. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to use the same idea. Yeah, I've done it before. I mean, the best I've, I've done was a rotor and two hinges. Which is a little bit much. No, the rotor and one hinge is enough. Honestly. Uh, for the left and right, and then up and down. <laughs> Here, I'll, I'll see. I'll do my method. So we're going to need a hinge, if I could spell. Hinge. So we're going to slap a hinge here. Um, oh, we're getting to deeper rocks now. Oh, I'm going to need a battery on this guy too. So let me do that. Because yeah, if can. I don't put a battery, the hinge will just fall. Uh... Battery cells. Do we have battery cells? Power cells. Power cells. Power cells. Probably not. Make some more. I think I should use a three by three battery or one by one. We're only operating a crane. Um, I will use the bigger one just in case. Okay, so there's an issue with my drill system. It looks like I think is it not moving stuff? Moving. Oh no, oh, the no, PC refinery is full. Oh, stop it. Uh oh. Cargo's full. Uh oh. <laughs> you so send it too hard. An, you send that's it too hard. That's an issue. Jeez. Was not expecting that to happen. <laughs> we need more cargo space. Or more basic refineries or a regular refinery because that is super slow to, to grab Do all that. Do have any uh, metal grids to make another cargo container? That's what we need, right? We're missing one. Uh, we have three. I mean, we can make a whole bunch of medium cargo for small grid and find a way to attach it. That's uh, another way of doing it, but... Make a connector. Connector could store some stuff. Yeah, we could do that. Or we just kind of wait for it to all produce. <laughs> okay, so... Um, yeah, it's going to take time. Let me, find, let me find a storage solution here. All right, you figure that out. Any construction components? We got any of that? Yep. You can go for a quick so. run for a cobalt. Uh, while you do that, I'll be working on this. And we should have cobalt. enough for storage then. Yeah, let me do that. I think that would be a better bet. Stop wasting time with these small grid, large grid conversions that don't make any sense. Yeah, let's be serious here now. <laughs> let's be serious. Wasting oh, time on this. I've got an idea how I want to build this. Okay, I got my cobalts. I have my cobalt hole marked so I don't fall in. All right, yep. Probably put a sign there. Yeah, because yeah, it's, it's hidden in the grass. <laughs> I mean, I think if you ran it with the rover over it, you should be okay for the most part, I think. But it still would be a little tough. I still don't like the fact that this thing is very bright heavy. <laughs> Just leaves the right. Mm hmm. Then we had. Then we had to fix that with the light. Uh, no, it still leans to the right. So I'm not sure why. Maybe we should just change the wheels. Because I don't see how this thing is unbalanced in any ways for left and right. 
It did not like me standing on top of it. It just threw me off of it. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't know. Let's see. Refinery. Still refining cobalt here. I mean, stone. Let's do the cobalt. So we can produce some metal grids. Can I rotate like this? Hmm? I should have kept one space apart, huh? Yeah. That's a little dangerous <laughs> to put the hinge and hinge with the landing gear on the battery. Because if you don't connect properly, you're going to blow up the battery. <laughs> well, don't, don't, don't do that then. <laughs> Just a little nudge. I think the battery's going to go. Uh, I still also need uh, pistons so yeah. it could stand on its own when I'm off the... Mm -hmm. So you're you're asking for trouble here, it looks like. No, this is not trouble. This is perfect. This is this is gonna work, okay? If it swings too much, I mean ideally you might want to put some min and max to the hinge near the landing gear, I think. Because last time I did it and left that default, it actually swung 90 degrees and smacked myself. <laughs> oh, that, that, that was your driving. <laughs> Well, who's driving? <laughs> who's gonna drive this time? <laughs> if I'm driving, we're gonna put min and max into it. If you're driving, I'll just see what happens from there. Remember yesterday we had a meteor shower and it was at our old base location? <laughs> we go there and it's gone. <laughs> that would be so bad. Uh, I have no good spot to put this cargo container unless we get rid of the small grid. Get rid of the small grid. Get rid of the small grid, yeah. <laughs> I mean, keep the, um, the O2 for now. Yeah, yeah. Well, it has, it has battery power on there too, right? Is that what it is? Oh, yeah, it has its own battery. Cargo number two is up and running. Your shower, that's not hitting us, so we're good. Yep, playing the crap out of it. Oh, see, you, I knew it. I knew it. I told you I it was going to happen. <laughs> I cut it off and I was trying to redo it. <laughs> oh, she's going to kill you. I don't want to build a crane anymore. I give up. <laughs> um, You know, you can just make a quick little system on the rover, right? <laughs> As a crane what? system, you could probably dangle it from the rover and hope for the best. <laughs> I'm not doing it. It's your design. I thought it was gonna work in my mind. I don't. I don't, I don't even understand what you're trying to do. To be honest, I was trying to make a small, compact version of a crane that only uses one rotor to spin. The seat oh. will still be somewhere like on the actual uh, base itself, so it won't spin with it. But the crane would just be a very small pivotal arm. Okay, so I've been playing a lot of uh, Snow Runner recently. <laughs> <laughs> and I got this one truck that has a crane, and I was trying to build the same thing like it. Which uses only one arm. But I think you need the seat or cockpit on that rotor to spin the whole thing. Do you? No, no, you don't. No, yeah, you're right, you don't. So... I'm just trying to keep it separated. Yeah, you don't, because if you're using a script, you just got to identify the right seat, so that should be okay. Mm So we finally made something simple, and that was the drill system, which is <laughs> extremely wobbly too. So a this scary. turned out a little bit more complicated than I want it to be. <laughs> even though I think we're gonna keep this crane for a very long time. Can you help me build the suspensions? Sure. How many pistons should I put on this to extend out the boom? Uh, probably another one. One more. Construction components. Come on now. We don't have any. We're out. Really? Mm-hmm. 
I'm, I'm just making them more. I'm queuing it up. I thought we were rich. Yeah, we're iron rich. <laughs> we're more sto this stone is rich than so iron fast. rich. Hmm? This base is grown so fast just because of that mini drill that you made. Yeah. And it requires so much freaking cargo containers. Simple drill. It, it did cost us uh, a lot of materials, but... I think it was necessary. Meteor storm inbound. Are you going to block the meteors with your crane system? <laughs> uh, it's acting weird. Imagine you get bat one away. <laughs> um, yeah, it that would be is so funny if I could bat one away. <laughs> um, what are you doing to this thing? I think I have to do it. Around here. Do you have to release. Is this hinge torqueless? No, nope, they're, they're all done. Oh. It doesn't seem to want to extend all the way. <laughs> Maybe it's not torqueless. Let's see. Oh, I know why. I changed up the maximum distance of the piston is too short. Because I had to do something. That's why I left it like that. Can you? Oh, there can you, you go. Change it? Hold on. Let me put this back slowly. Okay. Which piston is that one? Lift? There's only one piston. Change the limit from 0, 3 to like. Oh, okay. See it. So that's why. Yeah, the two. There you go. Oh, oh you went too much. Oh, I died. Ooh. <laughs> I don't know where I died. Um, I found it. Wow, my body location went far. Did it? Yeah. <laughs> I think we should end it there. Uh, I think uh, that is it for us. <laughs> Yeah, I think we have enough of Clang for today. Oh man, that was a Clang nightmare. Oh man, with all the hinges and everything, forget it. I think we need a fresh new start, fresh brain. <laughs> Rest a little, come back, and then tackle it again because that, that was a nightmare. Anyway, that is it for us, guys. Um, to continue our voyage, next week we are going to move our uh, respawn pod back to our base, whether we like it or not or however we want to do it but yeah that was pretty bad anyway that is it we'll see you guys next time thanks for watching